Welcome back to Amanda Plays Games, The Legend of Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom. So, um, I went ahead and activated this shrine, and this is kind of a cheater episode because I actually went in there and spent an infuriating 20 minutes trying to figure out how to do this um, puzzle. Couldn't figure it out, and so I am just going to not do that, not worry about it right now. I'll do it some other time, but I did not want to have to subject you guys to literally 20 minutes of me just not knowing what I'm doing, which is already kind of what you sign up for with this, but at least you get to see me mess up a little bit more than just infuriatingly go back and forth trying to figure out how to do this. So instead, we will just do the shrine, or not the shrine, we will just do the stable, check that out, and then we'll go on our way. So, here we go. We'll talk to this guy, Dofi. Let's see, what's in this issue of the Lucky Clover Gazette? What's the news? Freezing temperatures bring feathery shri shivers to the Rito. Rito Village is facing a food shortage as cold winds make travel to the village dangerous for resident and villager al visitor alike. That's awful. It sounds like they like anyone trying to get to Rito Village needs to prepare themselves for harsh freezing weather. There's so much to read in these newspapers. Are there any other stories? Blood moon brings dangerous nights. Be wary, dear readers. On nights when a blood moon rises, so too do monsters that have been defeated. Mm. Hmm, that reminds me of that researcher who was studying the blood moon. They were really excited to visit a monster fort to examine and examine the relationship between the monsters and the blood moon. Hope they're doing okay. I don't know if they'd be able to hold their own in a fight. Mm. Thanks for mm. reading me the news. Those magnificent geniuses at the Lucky Clover Gazette. Uh. Garshon. <sighs> Ridiculous. Those two are still bickering, even at this hour. Who are you talking to? The horses? I'm trying to look and see who he might be talking about. Nobody is around here. I don't care if it's that rumored beast or the legendary weapon. Can we just pick one and get along? Huh? Hmm? Do you need something? If so, you'd be better off asking the stable worker for help. I'm just a visitor. Ah. My older brothers have been arguing incessantly about where to go next. It's exhausting. I got so tired of listening to them that I had to seek refuge out here. Oh, oh okay. They're inside. I don't put much faith in either legends or rumors, but more than that, I find the caves in the fallen ruins caused by the upheaval to be a much, much more interesting area of study. Sorry, I'm running you over. Pony Points Ledger. Receive a reward. Oh. I'm sorry, but only stable members can use this. If you want to register as a member, go to the counter and ask. Okay. Read the ledger. This book contains useful member information for those who have registered with Stable Association. Which entry would you like to read? Points, points and reward. Members can check their pony point tally. What a tongue twister. And see available member rewards. For limited time, new stable members can receive a special sign-up reward. Please talk with stable manager. Okay, about pony points. Stable Association has a point system to reward members every time they use stable services. You can collect points in a variety of ways, like staying at inns and registering horses at stables. For a limited time, you get a reward. Okay. 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 Let's talk to this guy then. Hey. Still up and about after sundown, eh? Ah. Welcome to my stable. We deal in all things horse related. We also double as an inn. Hmm, it seems you're not a member yet. Ah. Our stable uses the stable association's member system membership system. So you'll need to register if you want to use it. May I ask for your name? It's Link. Aww. Link. All right, Mr. Link. There. You're all signed up. Now, would you like me to tell you about the stable system? Sure. Oh. 
Then allow me to explain. I need a drink. All this reading. You can board your horses, horse companions with us and then summon them as you please from our network of stables. You may have come across wild horses during your travels, ah. yeah? If you catch one and ride it here to register it, it will become your horse companion. There's a limit to how many horses you can board, but you're able to swap them in and out as you please. Oh. Once again, we welcome to our stable. Would you like to lodge with us? Regular bed is 20. Uh, Melania bed is 50. Ah. If you sleep in a Melania bed, not only will you wake up more energized, Melania, the horse god, may also share a mystical message. This makes it a very popular choice among lodgers. But we don't offer such luxury, luxury to just anyone. Only customers with at least seven pony points can use Melania beds. Okay. <sighs> I completely forgot to explain how pony points work. Okay, the ro it's a reward system you can use at the stables. In short, every time you use the service, you get points. No matter what stable you go to, you can get points for lodging there, registering a horse, stuff like that. Oh. Without further ado, since this is your first time visiting New Serene Stable, you get a pony point. Thanks. Pony points card. Using a stable earns points. Collecting points grants rewards. Points needed for the next reward, too. Ah. Save up points to earn a wagon load of wonderful rewards for you and your horse companions. Okay, such as... Ah. Oh. You can trade your pony points for prizes at the ledger counter over there. Check out the ledger for prize details, membership rules, and other information. Oh. Come back again anytime. So now will it show me... Receive reward. Ah. Save up just ah. two more points. You'll receive a towing harness. You can hook up your horse to various things. Appreciate it. Okay. What's this? Work in progress. Do not touch the proprietor. Okay. Thank you. Are these disguised uh, brothers? Hmm. A legendary weapon, you say? Onya, give the... A little more thought. Things with legendary in the title are usually just stories. There's simply no way it exists. Mm -hmm. But that rumored beast you're after... That's what's just a story. Hmm. No, no. Go to any stable in Hyrule and you'll find people excited about the rumored beast. Stables are places with inf where information gathers. If it weren't true, you wouldn't hear about it at so many stables. Oh. Even I grant you that. We don't stand to gain anything by finding this rumored beast. A legendary weapon, on the other hand, is bound to be strong indeed. We would have nothing to fear of monsters. Uh -huh. And what if this weapon is legendarily brittle or useless? Hmm. Let's start visiting stables to gather information and track down that rumored beast. Uh -huh. Okay, well, I guess I'll take a look. Whoops. There's a new recipe here. Looks like there's some kind of... Tomatoes? And some kind of mushroom to make a soup. Mm -hmm. Beetle is here. Yeah. Hey there. You felt? Are you a fellow traveler on a journey of life? It's me, Beetle. If you forgot, my beetle-shaped pack is right there to remind you. Yeah, yeah. In this topsy-turvy world, there's only one direction to go: forward. So when I travel, it's forward all the way. I can sell you bugs of the highest quality. And if you need anything else on your life journey, I can sell you that, too. Short on rupees? Don't worry, I'll buy anything you don't want weighing you down. And what better way to lighten up than to sell your rocks? Gemstones in particular fetch a high price. So, let's see. Uh, let's sell something first. Let's see what I've got here. I have... 30 opals. Let's sell a few of these. Oh no, I have two opals. Okay, I see how it works. They kind of like did it backwards now. I got it. Okay. Wow. 
one of those most used by type okay let's do um i guess that's it okay so then let's see what he's got i'll take an a i'll take the arrows whoops no what else have you got? I'll take all of your fire fruit. I know, I'm sorry, I hit the wrong button. And how many of these can I afford? Five of them, okay. Nope, that's it, thank you. All right, so let's see if we can get our horse. Hello, I'd like to take a horse, if you've got one. Ah. Link, welcome to our stable. If you catch a wild horse and bring it here, you can register it. Please visit the inside counter if you want to lodge oh. with us. Now, how can I help you? Oh. Ah. All right. I saw some horses over here. stuff all off. Remove. Uh, remove. Okay, so I shouldn't clack around quite so much. I'm telling you, I need my ninja stuff. So there's another Pinto. A couple of them. Really, any horse is fine, I would think. Okay. Alright. No. Alright. She's kind of cute. She's kind of like rose colored. And then there's a pooch here we can, if we have some meat, I don't even know if we have any. Hey. Yeah. Okay, well, let's register it. Oh, I don't have money. Okay, hold on. Oh, jeez. Uh, okay, hold on, horsey. Have an apple, so you love me a little bit more. Stay right there. Yes, 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 yes. Nope, not that. Bye. Oh, here we go. Amber. And, you know, buy a couple of Hinox toenails, too. I'm sure by the time I actually need them, I'll find another Hinox. Okay, bye, 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 bye. <laughs> Trying to register a horse. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I want to register this ah. horse. Hmm? You entrusted a horse to us once before. Oh. I'll just go ahead and register any horse that you had uh, your name that had your name on it. Come talk to me later if you want to take them out. Now then, once again, you want to register this horse here? Sure. 
Uh, we've got a special promotion going on right now, so you can register your first horse for free. Since you're registering a new horse, we'll add one point onto your pony points. Thanks. Uh, please enter the name of your horse. Let's do something real cute. Whoops. We will name this horse. Rosie. Okay. Rosie. Yeah. Uh, let's board my horse. Because I want to see which one they have. Okay. And now... Uh, take a horse. Oh, I kept all of them. Okay. I thought I just kept one. But I get to keep all of them. Mm hmm Let's take Midnight. Yeah, let's take him out. It's for waiting. Speaking of which, do you know about whistling? I do, in fact. Know all about that. I do it all the time on accident. So, he does not... He did not keep... His, um... Oh. Sorry, big... Uh, sorry, Midnight. He didn't keep his thing. His ancient armor, ancient saddle. Oh, a customer. Folks don't drop by this late at night. I'm kind of in the middle of something. Um... Oops, but if you like to use the stable, you can go up to the counter. What are you up to? <laughs> <laughs> well, since you asked. Yeah, what about it? <laughs> After a long, tireless search, I found a wagon to call my own. Look at this butte. <sighs> okay, yes, clearly it's a fixer-upper. But I can replace the missing wheels using building materials from the stable. Then I just have to catch a wild horse to hook the wagon up to it, and I'll be all set. Building materials? There's a stash of unused building materials at every stable. No, no two stashes will have the exact same materials. But they do have one thing in common. They're open for everyone to use. No questions asked. If you catch a wild horse, you can make it your own. There are lots of them around here, as a matter of fact. It's hard to catch them, though. You have to crouch down and sneak up on them, or they'll run away. Even after you do catch one, you have to soothe the horse so you'll get thrown off. I always messed that part up. <laughs> Trust me, so did I. Fine, don't offer to help. Yeesh, do I look like an, I can fix a horse-drawn wagon on my own? It's not as if I wouldn't pay it back. I give you all my savings, in fact. Girl, do you want my help or not? <laughs> Hello, Pepper. Can I pet a dog? Still not. Should be illegal. So do I have meat? I don't. I haven't killed anything. Okay. Sorry, puppy. I've got to come back. Oh. Well, here's a wheel. Uh, whoops. Can I take a picture of this dog? Ho oh, ho a doggo. Thanks. He's chasing his tail and everything. Okay, so let's, um... Whoops. I'm assuming this is what you want me to do, right? <laughs> okay, so we fixed it. Huh? What? It's fixed? Yeah, easy peasy, lemon squeezy, man. <gasps> it's fixed. Did you do this for me? Thank you so, so much. It's like a brand new wagon with wheels and everything. Now I'm only one step away from my dream of having a horse-drawn wagon. Of course, the last hurdle is the hardest, catching a wild horse. 
As soon as I get near a wild horse, it runs off. How am I going to catch one? Okay, I guess I'll do that for you too. It's like midnight out here. Good job, buddy. Midnight. All right, crouch down. <laughs> He's coming right towards me. <laughs> Ow, you kicked me in the... F <sighs> Jerk. He kicked me right in the face. Okay. I guess we'll try one of these guys. Okay, perfect. Oh. I was like, what is that creating that giant shadow? But. Over this way, so we can. Okay, whoa. Back up a little bit. Can we back up? Okay, here's a horse. You can have him. I caught him for you, so it's fine. Did you catch this angel for me? It's just what I pictured perfect for pulling my wagon. It's all yours. Huh? You mean that? You'd really part with such a wonderful horse? Sure. Thank you. Wow. Who knew this stuff like this really happened? I'm so, so happy. Let's go ahead and put a harness on it. Harness? A harness is a piece of equipment that you can put on horses you know. You own. <laughs> or you know. With a harness, you can connect your horse to a wagon or an item you need to take somewhere. If you collect enough pony points, you can get one as a prize. So bear with me a moment. And we're all set. I can't believe it. A wagon of my own and a beautiful horse to put it. Pull it. To think I started with an old, that old piece of junk and ended up with this. Amazing. <laughs> Thank you so, 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 so much. Here, it's all I have left after buying the wagon. I'm begging you. No, forcing you to take it, please. Thanks. <laughs> all right, there's one last order of business. What's your name? Link. Uh. Link. Hmm. Zoomy. Link. Maybe Zooey or Loomy. Or how about, what about Zunk? I'll call this wagon Zunk. Hee <laughs> hee. I promise I'll look after Zunk. What? A uh, name to call a thing. For as long as I live. Feel free to come visit the two of us anytime. <laughs> okay. Oh, let's boogie. We might be able to make it to... this tower in this area here? No, it's in the next area over. Okay. Oh, let's go. I bet that's this one right here. So let's cancel this. And put it Don't text and drive, kids. This must be yep, where we're going here. Get out of my way. Get out of the way! Oh. 
Okay. Whoops. So a lot of people might be, um, like, you know, unhappy that it's this basically the same map. I mean, you're in Hyrule still. Is that Hestu? <gasps> Hestu! Chalakala! Those trees over there. So scary, Chalakala. These normal trees? Or are they alive trees? He has to. Okay. All, um. Are they living trees? Yep, they are. Uh, let's do the flame emitter, I guess. doing any damage here? I don't feel like I am. Maybe I need something sharp. Where are you going? A high tail lizard? Okay. Oh, I got hit by a weird tree. I, with he I wish Hestu would tell me what's up with these trees. Okay. Shalakalaka. Kalakala. The scary things are gone. Hestu. You see me? You see me? My name is Hestu. I know, I've met you before. I'm the musician of Korok Forest up northeast. I'm known for my maracas and my dancing. Thanks for your help. Shashaka. To show my appreciation, I'll do a little dance for you and make your pouch bigger. But my maracas aren't working anymore. The Korok seeds inside are gone. How am I supposed to dance now? The children of the forest must have taken them again. Aww. If I had even one Korok seed, I could sing and dance and use my powers to help you. I got them. Korok seeds make a really great sound when you put them in my maracas. But the seeds spilled all over the place when I broke my maracas. And I think the children of the forest took the seeds when I, while I was in, all in a panic. Yeah. Hang on. <laughs> Do you have a Korok seed? Baby, I've got eight. You do? You got a Korok seed from one of the forest children? If you give me a Korok seed, I'll make your inventory bigger. Yes, please. Shalakala! So which stash do you want more slots in? Bows, I guess. Okay, I'll need just... I'll just need one Korok seed. Here we go. Ooh, it's different. Oh, oh yeah. Beautiful and marvelous and gorgeous. -da 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 -da. That was everything I could have ever wanted. Expand band band boat stash. Shakalaka. So, so are you happy with it? If you bring me more Korok seeds, I'll expand your inventory again. I certainly have more. I'm in the middle of traveling. I'm thinking about heading east next. There's so many monsters these days that traveling is dangerous. What I'd like to do is find somewhere I could relax. I like lively places, so maybe I'll go somewhere lots of people hang out. Wait a second. You have Korok seeds on you. I can smell them. I'll be here a bit longer. Want me to make your pouch even bigger? Yeah, let's do it. I just need one weapon stash. Let's do that again. Beautiful. I love it. Na, 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 na. 
Oh, look at the time. I gotta get a move on. I'll be heading east soon. I hope I can find a place where I can relax. I still don't have enough Korok seeds, so get out there and find more for me, okay? Alrighty, next time we meet, let's dance together. I love your new dance, honey. That was great. There's another sh Oh, that's the one. There's another shrine over there. Okay, let's head up to, oh no, do I gotta go down into a hole to get here? <coughs> oh my goodness! So, I don't know what is going on. I am sneezy. I don't have um, allergies or anything. But every once in a while... I'll just get it where I have to sneeze like five or six times, and it's ridiculous. Yeah, twang me into the sky, man. Okay, what's happening here? What's happening, and how do we make it happen for us? I guess I can just use this stuff to make a bridge or something, right? Mm. So this is what I mean, where we don't have one of the axes to work on. There's one part. Nope, we gotta ticket this angle and drop it. Cause that's just the simplest way, really. I didn't want to do that, I'm sorry. Turn it. Nope, that is not how I want to turn this. <sighs> okay. Is that enough? Tilt it this way, tilt it that way. Ta-da! Uh, <laughs> I think I've got the idea here. Execution was a little... Oh, jeez. One more? Is this not long enough? I mean, this might work. <laughs> it's a little janky, but this can work. So we'll go ahead and activate this, and then that will be the end of this episode. We've done a lot of horse shenanigans. Perfect. Lindor's Brow, Skyview Tower. And I will probably, I don't know, how do I do this? There we go. 
put this in here, skip this. Twang us into the sky, please. Shazam. Perfect. We unlocked Hyrule Ridge and the Tabantha Frontier. Sky map updated. Perfect. How do I get to any of the islands? Cause this looks like something that's floating, but I can't get there. Okay. Let's see if we can stop here. If we can make it, we will try to make it. Ta da! Now, is this an actual thing? I don't know. We will find out next time. So, thank you, everyone and anyone who was watching, and we'll see you in the next episode. Bye bye.